Hi everyone, my name is Phil and welcome to Phil Does 3D. I'm a multimedia and 3D artist and I stream live on Twitch on Mondays and Tuesdays at 5 p.m. Pacific Time in the United States. That's 11 a.m. if you're in Australia or around 1 or 2 a.m. if you're in the UK or Europe. I hope you guys are well and had a good weekend. Hellforge, good morning to you. It's always good to see you, buddy. Um, Halford says, are you good to play Cyberpunk today? Otherwise I can wait with redeeming the points. I had some family stuff I needed to deal with last week. So I missed the streams. Well, we're good to go whenever you want. I've installed Cyberpunk, so it's it's good good to go. Wh whatever you want to do, Halford, if you want to redeem that, we can do that. Um, remember guys, if you miss the live streams, you can catch up at any time by clicking the videos tab on my Twitch channel or going to my uh, YouTube channel, which is youtube.com forward slash Phil does 3D. Uh, if you're a YouTube viewer, you can get a link to my Twitch channel by looking in the description below my video. And if you want to wishlist the game that we've been working on, it's called The House in the Hollow. You can do that now by clicking the link Hellforge just popped into Twitch chat. Or again, going to the About Me section on my Twitch channel and in my panels, you will see a graphic that will take you to the Steam Store page. Or if you're watching me on YouTube, look in the description below my video and you will find a link to the Steam Store page. <laughs> okay. Um, remember, if you want to point, join the Phil Does 3D Discord server, click the link Hellforge has helpfully popped into Twitch chat. Or again, if you're watching on YouTube or at any other time, just go to the About Me section on my Twitch channel and you'll find a blue graphic that will give you an invite link to become a Phildo and join the Phil Does 3D Discord. Okay. Oh, on my website. If you want to know more about me and what I do, you can go to my website, which is build3d with a dot com on the end. I think that's everything. It's 2 a.m. Central in the EU, Hellforge says. <gasps> so late for you, dude. Okay, Hellforge has redeemed play a game. Extended stream play a game. <sighs> okay, so basically that's uh, Hellforge has redeemed some of his viewer points. And he wants me to play a game and the extended stream play a game is where I don't stream for two hours, but I stream for three hours. So uh, the stream today will be finishing an hour later instead of my time. What is it? 1 p.m. It'll be 2 p.m. <laughs> Helpful says for some reason I couldn't redeem the other one for 60,000. What's the 60,000 one? Oh, that's OK. It's just play a game viewer extended. So you had the 60,000 points, but it wouldn't let you redeem. Is that what you're saying, Hellforge? I might have to check that if that's the case. Explain. What do you mean? Why couldn't you redeem it? What did it say? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. So what, it just wouldn't let you redeem it? Or you didn't have enough points maybe to redeem it? It doesn't give me the button to redeem it. Maybe because you didn't have enough points. Just had the text info, but no actual button. Oh, OK. Well, that's interesting. I'll check that after the stream because I've only just added those new rewards for players, uh, for viewers to redeem. I will check it. Oh, you had it. OK, so you had enough points. All right, I'll check that after the stream. Thanks for letting me know. Um, I can't see why it would not be doing it, but I will check it. Uh, there is a cooldown, like uh, if you're a viewer, you can only use one of these redemptions once in a seven day period. Uh, these are the player game and extended stream ones. Um, so you, you can only use it if, once per, per viewer in a seven day period. And if you, um, if you redeem one of them, then I don't, no one else can redeem one on the same stream. So you, I can't have two of my viewers both wanting an extended stream and redeeming their points. So I have a six hour stream at that. But I'll check it anyway. Thanks for letting me know though. Okay, so we won't be working on the gate today. So let's close down Max. Uh, Hellboy says, now it gave me the button for the expensive one. Damn Twitch. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> That's okay. You don't need to use the expensive one. So normally the player game extended stream is a game that I choose to play, but I will, because you're one of my wonderful moderators, I will let you do it. Um, 
So yeah, we, we'll work on this tomorrow. So we're doing a gate for the game. So I'm just going to close Max down and close Paint it out. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, guys. Uh, let's see here. We're going to be playing the uh, game Cyberpunk 2077. So let me get everything organized. We're going to start by pausing the music. I'm going to put my play a game extended up. So we're going to be playing Cyberpunk 2077 for the next three hours. I'll put my uh, headphones in or my earbuds in. Okay, hopefully I won't yell at you guys too much because when I've got these in, I can't hear the, the volume of my voice. So if I yell, let me know. Helpwood says, uh, I have some coffee while the game loads up. Good suggestion. Let's say mark this as complete because we're going to be doing this now. And let me get my controller. Again, I'm going to be using an Xbox controller to play the game instead of keyboard and mouse. I just, I like the controller. Uh, Helpwood says that's the only downside with SSDs. The game loads so fast you can't take a drink. <laughs> and let's start up Cyberpunk. Now we're going to be playing on max settings on everything because I've got a, an RTX 3090 so everything is pushed up to the max including ray tracing. I'm just noticing that my audio is not coming through to you guys, so I'll check what's going on there. Just got to wait for the game to finish so I can get back to my desktop. Okay. Let's see what's going on. System audio, it should be. Oh, I know. This happens because these earphones that I wear don't register with the operating system until I actually pull them out of the um, charger and put them in. And what happens is NDI, which is what I use to send my stream to my, my game to my stream machine, uh, doesn't see it because when it starts up, it's, it hasn't been activated. So all I have to do though is I just have to exit out of NDI and start it up again. Okay. Now they've shown up, so we should be good. Let's try that again. Is that too loud for you guys? One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed because the NCPD will not let that go. Got or is it too soft? How is the audio on the game? Runners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. While over in Westbrook, trauma teams scraping cyber psycho victims off the pavement. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll wait till I start playing. Seems God. okay. All right. Well, let me know if it's too loud or too soft, okay? The audio on the game. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Okay, so this, we're going to be starting a brand new game.
Um, I haven't played the game since I bought it, like when it was released. But we do have everything turned up to the max. I'm just going to continue, which is right at the very beginning. I've already chosen my character, which is Corpo. And we're starting the game in the bathroom, which is where the game starts for the Corpo character. It is a pretty game. They made um, nice environments, very colourful and really interesting. You love the look of the game, Helpful? Yeah, it is. They've done a really nice job, CD Projekt Red. Is there any music in this game I should be worried about? Do you guys know? Militech hit three of ours. Now we're evacuating the rest of our facilities in that part of Europe. What's the status of the three? They're dead. Once everyone else is safe, we'll issue a statement to the media. Only while driving, okay. A tragic accident during routine security system maintenance would be my bet. Mr. Jenkins asked for you. Hey, V. He's in his office. It's been ages. It's me, Frank. We met during Icefall. East Coast, remember? <laughs> I didn't know you were in Night City. How have you been? Ah, uh, you know how it is. A week ago, I was still in Cape Town. I heard you encounter Intel. Most of a shit show on your hands right now after Frankfurt. Jenkins is your lead, right? Is he what everyone says he is? Uh, Hellforge says, I think there's a streamer setting thing in the options menu so it doesn't play copyright music. It's been almost a year since I last checked though. We'll have a look at that after we finish this dialogue tree. V, everything okay? What's everyone say about Jenkins? That he's effective, like any psychopath. Apparently, he's gone a little crazier lately. Hey, he's in a tough spot. The director was supposed to greenlight his promotion when the Japanese arrived. She stabbed him in the back instead. And you, who do you work under? Abernathy. She's really good. Came up with the whole Cape Town ploy on her own. Abernathy. The bitch who burned my boss in the promotion to spec Such ops director. language. <laughs> you know how it is. Things happen. Yeah, they do indeed. Tell me about the op in Cape Town. Operation Cargo. You know about it? Arming local conflicts in Africa. I didn't know that was you. It was me. We dumped crates full of rifles into the ocean. They had to be pulled out using borrowed fishing boats. Same old circus, but hey, that's how wars are won. Listen, sorry, uh, in a bit of a rush right now. We'll talk another time, okay? Sure, sure. Good seeing you again. Uh, let's see if I can't find that option in the menu.
I'm just going to save the game real quick. Wonder where it would be. I don't know where it could be. Sound miscellaneous, okay. Oh, I see, I'm going blind, thank you, oh, butch. Disable copyright music, there we go. Just, that'll just keep us nice and safe from any problems we might have with uh, Twitch and copyright. Emergency protocols active. System security confirmed. Hopefully, <laughs> watch this. Yeah. Hopefully, that will keep us safe. Jenkins boy. Oh, they don't like me, obviously. Well, oh, bugger them. Please enter the antechamber. And we're playing, of course, in, in 4K. Can you get access to their preliminary... Have a seat, V. Be right with you. We have to handle this voting issue before we lose our bases in the Sea of Clouds. They're about to begin. What's the situation? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just as we thought. You know what to do. Start now. <laughs> Director Abernathy. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? The deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on us. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. Told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. We're not done talking about this. Mm, she doesn't sound happy. I hate that bitch. I always have. Always, meaning how long? Before Night City, we worked on an assignment in Osaka. Two years of subterfuge. She spent them digging a trap for me. When she became director of Spec Ops. And that's when she finally shoved me in it. It was a bit, bit extreme, how Ford says, I agree. Now she's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she needs it. I do what she doesn't have the guts to do. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. <sighs> Effective. What would you do in my position? You have to defend yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. You're right. That's right. No one wants to be a doormat. But hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Take this. The data shard. Proof of my trust. Go on, take it. It's what I've collected over the past weeks. I don't know if I'd willy nilly stick data things in my head, but anyway. Associates. Driver. Chief of security. Lover. Lover's husband. Everything. Use it, and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. 
You said it. I need to defend myself. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are thanks to me. So it's not like they could ever believe you played no part in it. Well, doesn't say much for my work ethic. <laughs> Help which is considering some of the comments I've seen about the super tall vampire lady in Resident Evil Village. I'm almost willing to bet money on that, that there are some people who'd be all for being a doormat. I've seen, I actually watched a Let's Play of uh, Resident Evil Village, a really nice looking game. And that, that character was super creepy. All the characters are really creepy in that game. They did a good job on making things really creepy. What will happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. This isn't a request, V. We seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Mm, cash is good. Credit ship transactions are traceable. Paper disappears as soon as you spend it. What can I say? Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah, I think we're clear. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. Jenkins, okay. Night City Counter Intel. So we get to go and ride in a flying car now. I have those reports you asked for. You're late. They were supposed to be ready yesterday. I I know, but I I have them now. Send them to my inbox, and you and I will have a word about this later. <laughs> so mean. Hey, v, oh. you alive? I'll stink to the Viper pit. Hellboard says, yeah, but the castle interior with all the filigrees look great. It did. They did a really nice job. They did a nice job with all of uh, Hell, uh, all of Resident Evil Village, hey, uh, the characters and the... Uh, the characters and the environment. Viper pit. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. How do I get in here? How do I get in here? There we go. Would help if I hit the button, wouldn't it? Make sure I open them all. I'm not going to bother reading. Elfwood <laughs> says that usually helps. Yeah. Elfwood says playing games to take your mind off work. Reading in game work email. <laughs> reading in, in game work email. I know. That's why I don't read it. I'm just going to make sure I've accessed everything.
Shall we use the cognitive booster? Why not? I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Upwood says, uh, it's copy, basically, a cognitive booster. Isn't copy? I agree, it is. I think that's whatever he just inhaled, probably a bit stronger than copy, though. So basically, you just made copy. <laughs> is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Tell me. Quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be on to him. They recently granted him red security clearance. That's top. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point? They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean. Bleached server clean. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Should we green light Xfil or let him keep looking? Keep him digging, I think. Keep him there digging. We invested way too much getting him that deep to back out now. You sure? Do I really need to repeat myself? Oh, of course not. Well, there you go. Don't question me. <laughs> All these holographic graphi uh, graphics they have are really cool. Like the screen here in the middle of the table. I have nothing to add. She has nothing to add. They'll be searching for dirt on us now. Lunar bases are huge to them. They won't forgive us for this. The world's going to tear us apart when the word gets around. The world's never going to find out. And the few who do know the truth, they won't know it for long. Yes, I'm looking at you. Oh, not happy. <laughs> uh, help which is, yeah, there's plenty of cool holograms when you get out in the world and walk around. Access. Shame my computer can't run it at any decent graphics setting. The same thing with Star Citizen. <gasps> Must be our flying car. Please provide your destination. Bring up district analytics. Increased NCPD presence and activity has been reported in Haywood. No official statement has been forthcoming. Intercepted radio communications suggest MaxTac has been sent to the area. A widespread power failure has been reported in Santo Domingo. All other districts exhibit activity within expected parameters. You even got a mini bar as helpful says yes, I know, nice ride. Destination, destination Lizzie's Bar. Noted. En route. Let's take a drink. Why not? This is M54 News broadcasting with a breaking story for you. A conference of the European Space Council screeched to a grisly halt following a failure in a neural stabilization system. Five European Space Council members are dead, while three remain in critical condition. Authorities are still looking into what might have caused this shocking incident. The council members were all wearing Biotechnica-provided devices. The corporation's representatives have, as yet, refused to comment. Our reporter is on the scene. 
We'll have updates on developments as they come to light. Stay with M54 News for the latest. Very blade runnery, which is good, because those movies were great. Hello, V. Yes? We weren't scheduled to connect till the end of the week. Quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? <laughs> Even got a mini bar living the good life right there, Hellboard says, yeah, I know. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Sure, okay. See you later. Destination. Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Oh, I think we're going to a titty bar. By the judge, judging by that little neon sign there, it's going to be a titty bar. <laughs> With axes, help watch this. <laughs> Them psycho suit. This look like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking crushed us. Jesus Christ. Okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. Uh, interesting design style these guys have and what they wear, but anyway, <laughs> particularly this one. Leave me alone. Trouble once in. I don't want any trouble. Just here on business. Good to hear. Welcome to Lizzie's. Wouldn't want to mess with her with a baseball bat. Sniper girl, good to see ya. Um, Hellforge redeemed his player game extended stream. So I'm going to be streaming for three hours today. You'll come here often, do ya? <laughs> it's good to see you, Garon. Now sit down and tell me what's got your shorts in a night. It's good to see you too, Jack. How you been? I got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking, as long as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, you know how it is. Can't complain, <laughs> but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Sniper Girl said so much for a, a uh, problem of yours. an art stream. Is this Hellforge? It is Hellforge's fault. <sighs> Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. Por supuesto. I'm serious. This I'm doing really well, that's not a girl. I hope you are too. Ruin me. <laughs> so could I. <laughs> so yeah, you today's stream is uh, an extended stream, so Guys instead of finishing after two hours, I'm going for three hours today. Border. I peep one word. I know, you saved my ass. What about the cartels that gotten out? But it didn't. 
And this won't either. Oops. <laughs> like my controller disconnected for some reason. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. Data shard. Take it. Just make sure my aerial is out here enough so that the controller doesn't have a problem picking it up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Won't come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie, maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention a solo. Huh. Piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? This is your destiny. This is your destiny. You Delicate situation, I know. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation, hermano. It's a hit job, plain and simple. You know how Arasaka operates. Or, okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. And you should too. Now, what do you say we lick her up and talk life? Gracias, mamita. Lick her up. Double tequila with grenadine and lime. Ooh. Nothing better for drowning nerves. I do like tequila, I have to admit. Do this. My younger oh, days, tequila was one of my the favorite hell drinks. Mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana, to the mamacita you meet at the bar, but this doesn't say a damn thing. Do this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Un pacto con el diablo. Been saying it all along. Arasaka fuckers. Today, swearing. they got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. I think I have a choice. If I refuse, they take everything and leave me nothing. Now, well, let them. They'll also take the fist they got gripping your balls. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. And Saburo and his matones. Oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday, but for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always. Re hey, you lost? Got a problem? V, is that right? You're from Arasaka HQ. Is there a problem? Are you here about Frankfurt? We're here for you. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. No, don't believe I will. That's between me and Jenkins. Gah, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. That Give us the good. data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. I guess I better give it to him or I'll die. Information's on the shard. Smart choice. Formalities? Yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move oh, yeah, it. Been I think you fellows might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Get out of Is that a threat? You start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? We have what we came for. We'll do for now. Of 
Precies. Snap against the other language, I know. <laughs> Which is the same though, they swear in that game as well, all the time. Like like shit. My throat's like sandpaper. I'm not sure I can breathe. It's like when my little primito was ditching drugs. Nasty chills. Trembling hands. Cold sweat and dry even. Yeah. Sounds about right. Hey, hey, should I get you to a ripper? Or, I guess, maybe drama team's on its way. Give me a minute. Get my shit together. That, that'd be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life. Completely. I'd say you got it back. Couldn't say no to all, so they said it to you. This is a turn for the better. You'll see. Besides, you haven't lost everything. I'm about to say I, I still have a friend. That's sweet. <laughs> no, dumbass. You still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably some fat ass chunk of cha chain. Right for a new start. That's right, fool. Buckle up. Hey, you hearing all right? Don't look so well, that's not good. V, V. Hey, hermano. Uh, your new life. It starts now. You gotta watch that tequila, boys and girls. It's very scary stuff. <laughs> Snapper Girl says I'd shoot them, yeah, I wish I was in an option. Alfred says cool laser lighting in the background, yeah, I was looking at that as well, it did look very cool. The environment's pretty good, Sniper Girl says. Yeah, they did a really nice job with the um, the look of the game, from what I can see. I decided when I made the character, I didn't make him look too Check hideous. What looking for somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Sure. Why the hell not? Now you get to see just how rubbish Phil is at playing a game. Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. <laughs> Snappy Girl says how rubbish, I think we already know that. And Helper says, I just put it down to using a controller. That's going to be my excuse for everything. It's the controller. And Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, 
Station one, you maggot. Move, oh, move, I'm a, move. I'm a, I'm a maggot now. Hope okay. You're ready to bust ass through this fascist playground. Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. Shoot with right tab, aim with left tab, reload with X. Say we crank it up a notch. My great. This, this joystick is really sensitive. That's my excuse. It does. It seems really not bad, but it's more realistic if the target's packing iron. Quit standing around and take cover. Why am I not crashing? Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, look, we brought some chooms with him this time. You know what to do, V. What the hell? Damn. Yeah, I know, I'm standing and getting shot. This as well as a simulation in real life. It's my controller keeps disconnecting. Hang on, I'll move my Bluetooth area a little bit closer. See, that's the excuse. It's not me, it's the control. Stream work, V. Stand on the platform and we'll move on. <laughs> hey, Android Lust, it's good to see you. <laughs> I told you I was rubbish. Uh, <laughs> hang on, let me catch up here. Um, sightseeing? Oh, shut up. I hate it when these NPCs get narky when you don't want to do what, what they ask you to do. Um, <laughs> Snappy Girl says, and if someone decides to use their own controls scheme, it's at their fault. <laughs> 
You finally hit something, you can die happy, Sniper Girl says. I thought it's easier to hit something when you're holding down the trigger on a full auto weapon. Yes, Cyberpunk Android lost um, Hellforge redeemed his extended stream the next item on the player menu. game. Might so, I the today's stream is three hours, not two, while we play Cyberpunk. Now, what, what am I supposed to be doing here? Complete all training modules. What? What? It's the gun sniper girl says. Need a handwritten invite? Android Lust says, uh, I'm great. Recently finished a little mini project. Cool. Sniper girl says, nice. The erosion project or something else. Android Lust says, I can't aim at all with the controller. Yeah, well, I've, I'm finding, no, I'm, no, all joking aside, guys. The controller, when I do this, when I go to move the, the reticule, it's really sensitive. It doesn't. Whereas the mouse, I might switch back back to the mouse, you know, it might be easier. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just put the controller down. Uh, and go with the um, mouse. I've just got to remember which button's which now with the mouse and keyboard. Okay. What's the fire button here? Anyway, I'll work it out. We'll work it out. How do I open my scanner though? What's the key? the wrong key. The keyboard to open, scan the object. So how do I open my scanner? Not a gonk brained Militech recruit. Get moving. Uh, hang on, I've got, I've got to work out how I open my scanner. Shoot, aim, quick attack, reload. Scan. Hold the tab, okay. confused.
This training module will teach you how to apply technological tools to guns. Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. I might go back to using the controller. <laughs> it might be easier. <laughs> uh, uh, hang on, what's going on here? <laughs> For the next two hours, we'll be standing here looking at his scanner. <laughs> and it was in use, so Android lost this. <laughs> I told you I'm worried. I have, yeah. Uh, Android Lost says, I thought I had another, so I tore open the boxes and still had it packed. Hadn't fully unpacked it. I'm, I'm just going to change some settings here. Um, let's change this from tab to... F1. I'll find that easier. Navigate to list available quick hacks. Select this. Hang on, distract enemies duration cause the device malfunction. F to use. Thank you, Hellforge. <laughs> Corpo trash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. Oops, All she's right. slow. All yours. Focus V. Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Corpo trash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. All right, all yours. Take him out. Come on, you got this. Uh, let's try it again, I guess. Third time's a charm. Work a little hack magic on the screen to just... Crack the guard. Corpo trash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. All right, all yours. Take them out. We'll do a kill Never one. Never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork. No. Especially the dead kind. It's a robot anyway. Body and hide it somewhere. Ah. Uh, really? Try to take him down in one slick move. 
Think you're ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Have fun! needed to shut your brain down and follow orders in true Militech fashion. Under my wise command, you're a real champ. Andrew Doss says, I thought I had another, so I tore open boxes that I still hadn't packed. Uh, yes, I didn't fully unpack from the move. <laughs> it always takes me like months to get everything fully unpacked after I've moved, so. Back to your training, uh, recruit. Snappy Girl says, I uh, gotta remember he's on a control. Yes, I'm using, I'm trying to use a keyboard and mouse now because it's that. Uh, I have more control with the mouse. The, the controller, it's too sway. But generally I like to use the controller to play a game. Even though I am rubbish. <laughs> uh, yes, F to use. That was a big help. Thank you, Hellforge. <laughs> Ten times the charm. Watch that because look, I did it in three. I did it in three. I was good. <laughs> Not too shabby. Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Or you finish up, dealt out now. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. I guess I better uh, complete all the training because I'm pretty crap. Invite? Right. So first, let's shape up those stealth skills. How do I target them? And press what? I'm pressing my mouse. I'm confused. <laughs> Creative Steve, how are you? They've got me playing a game today and I'm really rubbish at playing computer games, so... Enjoy the entertainment! <laughs> uh, Creative Steve says, wait, who redeemed Phil to play a game? I forgot about this. Hellforge redeemed play a game extended stream. So I'm playing Cyberpunk 2077 uh, for three hours today. Middle mouse button. Yeah, I know. I've been I've been clicking the middle mouse button, but it's not um, it's not tagging. I'm clicking the button. Why would it not be working? I am clicking it. Trust me. So I'm not sure why it's not uh, tagging. Let's check the settings again.
Hang on. Andrew Lust says it is tagging. Middle mouse button, I think, to tag. Hopwood says your face is covering tutorial tips. Android Lust says it is tagging. There was a fourth person. Oh, okay. Thank you, Android Lust. <laughs> Enter the training area. I missed one of the people, okay. <laughs> Sniper Girl says, did you tap, have to tell him to Android last? Nice, Sniper Girl. You want to make me look like an idiot, which isn't hard to do. Find cover, quick. Nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Just like that. Um, Andrew lost this because tagging in this game can be a bit weird. Well, later on. Sniper Girl says I'm probably the biggest <laughs> a-hole in the stream and someone... Uh, and someone... and somehow I'm a mod. How am I supposed to get across here with him standing there looking directly this way? How? How am I meant to get across there? They want me to go back here or something. There is no way I can cross there without him seeing me. So... Wait. Can I fall down there? Can I even get over there? No. says I just run full sprint past the last one to the exit. Double tap WASD. Oh thanks uh, thanks for that uh, Android <laughs> oh, I'm gonna do help or just trick. Come on, you got uh, I got How are you enjoying? So yeah, look, I like the game. I like the environment. They've done a really nice job with the um, the look of the game. But we've only just started playing it, and I've not played it since I bought it last year. How am I meant to get past this guy if he's always looking this way? Okay, I forgot to crouch. Quick. Nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. How is that? How? What? What? 
stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Just like that. Can I take him down? No. All right. Nova, well done. On to the next area. Probably not the best way to sneak through, but anyway. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Well, we doing this? Nice work today. Just stand on the platform to exit the sim. All right, some advanced combat techniques for dessert. Then we wrap this party up. This will be fun. Helpwood says easy to sneak when all the guards are dead on the floor. That's my method of stealth. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Time to get down and dirty in close quarter combat. Take him down, but careful. Looks tough. Almost, almost. Again, from the top. Okay, that'll do. Now maybe we find someone closer to your weight class. Bump things up from easy to normal. This next pool can block your attacks.
dull bit coming up now. Block and blow instead of deep. Now this fool loses his footing every time he swings. Use it. Get in there and land a counter punch. air next. Don't let him land anything. You've done well in mastering the way. Let's move on to melee weapons. Grab a sword. Now show me what you've learned. Oh, come on, man. What? Give me a break. I want a gun, not a sword. Good stuff. Looks like you're cruising already. Hop on the platform. Not fair. I want a gun. I don't want a sword. Uh. Good luck, V. <laughs> it's not because it's how many years will it take you to complete the tutorial? Oh, what says that's why I redeemed a three-hour stream. Thinking ahead, as she says. <laughs> Creative Steve says the tutorials seem to be well made. Oh, yeah, they do. Android losses the uh, the tutorial is well made, but it won't prevent you from dying. Obviously, 
particularly Phil dying. Snappy Girl says, uh, and there were Kung Fu fighting. <laughs> Elfwood says, no scratch there on the wall. And Grady Steve says, this game always looked fun to me. It, I've not ever played it. Like I said, I bought it and I haven't played it. It's, I wanted to wait till they patched it up. Before I started playing it, because when it was first released, it had a few problems. But it seems to be pretty stable from what I can tell now. So, not bad, huh? Now we can get down to biz. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. Let's do this. I thought they were going to have me drive then. I thought that's that's going to be a mistake. Elevator. This way. Phil, Phil, Phil driving. a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Help sure us a fault, few but problems. That'll make you a squad. <laughs> squad. Charming. Creative Steve says, somehow I thought today was Tuesday for some strange reason. It is actually where I am, but I don't... I, I stream on Mondays and Tuesdays US time, but I come to you from the future if you're in the US and it's actually Tuesday here me but we don't talk about that because it confuses everyone looking for 1237 target should be inside but I got zero eyes on her bio mom. fingers crossed it's not too late is that you oh, I hate this life or death shit hurry try hacking the door think you can trip it on your own V Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corporal Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. Mmm, nasty.
if you can kill them. <laughs> Sniper girl says. Credit C says cat jam. She says I need a spill we're talking about. see how I can get in there without um, killing them. our target. Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. Ooh, big gun. Why is he still moving? Is he alive? Should I kill him? I don't think he's dead. I think he is now. <laughs> no, he's still alive. He's not there. Uh, Sniper Girl says, Tony didn't say that to me, I feel like killing them, no. Nope. <laughs> That's right, I was hugging him as Sniper Girl says, he's sleeping now, he's sleeping. He's just taking, just taking a little nap. Used air hypo. No, I don't want that. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, that's not good. Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. <sighs> this does not look good. She's in the tub of ice, crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. People who live through shit like this get panic attacks. Without ever knowing why. You'd be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack, into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. 
Um, Hellforge says, I think your pistol is using electric ammo, so you're knocking them out instead of, oh, instead of killing them, okay. We get it together. Yeah, 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 yeah. These are impatient, these NPCs. Sandra Dorset, NC5 Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, t -bug. You ain't seeing this. Nipergill says, to be honest, your stream would be more boring without me negging you. <laughs> hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Is that even safe? Can we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomon working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims Trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, hermano. Do your thing. B, need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Hey, catch, Mato! I think. Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabron. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. on the stretcher, which is it? Five steps back, now. You're welcome. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secure. Stimulus being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for vintages. Listen, Mano, I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's it gonna look for me? Only if you hanging, Jack. I like what they've done with the environment. The texturing and everything is quite nicely done. Saving my ass, V. Thank you. The lighting How about as well. I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. <clears throat> v, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. 
course she's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you are to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Oh, thank God. If I was driving, <laughs> you would not want to see me driving. <laughs> Man, that would have been a major mistake, had me drive the car. Oh, Helpwood says, I think, uh, sorry, uh, Snappy Girl says, a man carrying a nude woman wouldn't look suspicious at all. No, that's right. Creative Steve says, nope, not at all. I hope I'm not going to get have a problem with this music on Twitch with um yeah I, I I put the streamer thing on but let's just double check that because I don't want to have issues with um copyright yeah we've got disabled copyright music on so we should hopefully be safe. <laughs> Is there a way to turn off music in a car? I'd rather have no music playing anyway. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Uh, help which is, yeah, it looks really good in general. It, yeah, they've done a really nice job from what I can see so far. Even more so maxed out graphics, and we are, we are maxed out. Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Maxed out of 4K. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson and Bruce. Oh shit, that right. Got you, asshole! B, aim for the driver! Chicago! <sighs> Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. You can wait. Gang members trying to shoot up your car? Yeah, I just realized. <laughs> car chase hype, as uh, Credit Steve says. They're better shots than he is, Snappy Girl says. Well, that's not hard. A three year old would be a better shot than I am. Um, Alpha says, of course, they have auto aim, that's right. <laughs> Kappa, Credit Steve says. Watson's on lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? Ooh, look at what the is it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm going to be worried sick if I don't show. I mean... I'm trying to be a stand-up guy, 
giving me a chance. Waiting. Hmm. That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay. On your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. Officer, ma'am. when you feel like it. When am I not nice? Um, always? I'm always never not nice. <laughs> Windscreen needs a bit of work. Girl says, Sorry, uh, likely to make it back to Haywood. Yes, yeah, Snapper Girl says, Third time's the charm. <laughs> sure about that? Oh, Cheeky, you'll get a fill slap. <laughs> Admittedly, I don't take my own advice, Hellboy says. He sometimes it helps to talk instead of flashing iron. Into. I think I'm more technical, so we'll do technical, I think. Uses damage taken from explosives. Damn. I'm just curious to see the outside a little bit more before I head to my apartment. Can I get out? No. Alright, we'll go to the apartment, I guess. Sweet, 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 clean speed. Cause life 
life is too short to be slow. Kaboom! Soya sold my chistador! An explosion of chase! When a phantom witch leads to a fatal system. Good evening, Night City! My first guest tonight is the president of the Church of El Yacht. I forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to thee, our Father in heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip End program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. I love treating you, beautiful. Can't complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Now, I'd like us to talk about the most exclusive and highly sought after. I think uh, I have some uh, clothing options because I purchased the game when it first came out. There are some clothes I think you got as part of purchasing the game. to look in the mirror. Why is it only giving me that? I want to pick this up. Uh, let me catch up with the chat. Just realized you can write mod comments about people Sniper Girl says. Freddy Steve says, Sniper Girl, what's Sniper Girl doing? Gifted tier one sub to Creative Steve. Oh, thank you, Sniper Girl. That's very nice of you to gift um, Creative Steve a sub. Very nice of you. Yes, so thank you for that, Sniper Girl. I don't want to look in the mirror. How do I pick this up? What's going on? Why can't I pick it up? There a reason it won't let me pick it up? Here we go, I've got to be far, far enough back from it before it'll let me take it. What's that all about? If I'm too close, it wants me to look in the mirror. Okay, fine. Spunky monkey. Mm. With a name like that, why not? We have some messages waiting. Scam alert. Okay. <laughs> Do not click any emails with ads for penis enlargement. <laughs> no way.
This is what I'm wearing at the moment. And I guess I should go to bed because that's what it's telling me it wants me to do. Let's have a look around a little bit more first. Snappy Girl says, I meant to do it anonymously. <laughs> anonymously, I like to normally do, but I forgot to click it. Well, it's very generous of you, Snappy Girl. Thank you for, for gifting that sub. Uh, Android Lust says on the phone, sorry, I'm back in a bit. Selfwood says, uh, back up a bit and you should be able to get it. Yep. Yeah, obviously I was too close to the mirror and that's why I couldn't uh, pick anything up. So I guess we should go to bed for a while. Elfwood says, you know the answer better than most. Grissom, Grissom DJS, thank you for the follow. Oh no, you're, you you subscribed. Thank you, Grissom, for subscribing to Build 3 d Now, I'm normally a 3D artist and we make 3D assets and we're working on a game at the moment. But today um, we're playing a game called Cyberpunk 2077 because one of the viewers requested it. So. Oh, okay. Grissom says I went by a different name, but I've come in here for a few years. No worries. Neurovirus, sir. I'm doing. Let him tell me what's got my head. It's been some time, Grissom says. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. And thank you for the sub. I do appreciate it. And same to you, Sniper Girl. Thank you for gifting the sub. It was very nice of you. You guys are awesome. Okay, I guess we're going to meet Jackie downstairs. So, what? You embarrassed? No, that ain't it. Hey V, Regina yes. Jones here. If Just you're looking for work in Watson, later, give right? me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later V. 9999 Team. Open up. Don't forget, Gun you're worth it. We're here to help. Yeah, what was what's going on there? Was that upstairs? Not gonna let me talk to him. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Prepare for cooler conditions as we head into the weekend. Enjoying the weather? Average temperatures this month in Night City have remained within human safety levels. How do I get downstairs? Just jump down, do it for science. You want me to jump over the balcony? You, well, you, you would want me to jump down there. 
No. No, you're just trolling me, Sniper Girl. But I might have to because I can't see how to get down from here. I can see stairs here, but how do I get in there? What am I missing? Hang on, does it want me to go back up? He's not happy. He wants that Mars bar. They like shiny, shiny clothes in the future, don't they? Huh? Ooh, cockroaches. Nasty. I think he's having a bit of a problem there. Collect your gun from Wilson. Who's Wilson? Let's have a look. Collect your gun from Wilson. A little out of it, huh? Come on, spit it out. Let's have a look. I'm confused. What am I doing? Thanks a lot. I thought about it. They all wear a Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest from around the world. Hello, it's time for your local news. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. So many TVs everywhere. I love TVs in the future. Um, Grissom says I went by a different name. I went by Hick Controls for a few years. I changed my name, my name for a stream, but never changed it back. Jump down, do it besides that. Yeah, I'm not going to jump down. <laughs> Um, Helpwood says, I think the elevator's on the same level as your apartment. Uh, Snobby Girl says, yep, shiny clothes. Look like they're wearing a shape colored trash bag. Uh, Cody Steve says, those are nice TVs. Yes, there's TVs everywhere. They love TVs in the future. The dress sense of some people is very odd, though. I mean, hey, wear what you like. Hello. That's fine. Are we going to talk about yesterday? Why would I want to fight crime? I'm supposed to. I thought I was supposed to be a criminal. Help 
Nicholas says, well, when you live in a rundown trash pile, having a few TVs gives you something to do. I guess, I guess that's true. Snappy Girl says, uh, gravity is just a theory. Jumping should be fine. <laughs> you mm. want me to die. <laughs> Jeez, took you long enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. I'm more interested in looking at the city. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. I'm hungry now. I remember in right or just have After seeing food, I'm hungry. Probably both. Because you usually forget shit. Mmm. I mean, just so pork happens. Buns, yum. I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J O B. I love some pork buns. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that. Elkwood says you fight crime by committing crime. Batman told me that. That's right. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. <laughs> 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. <laughs> Next to Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was a little vacay. <sighs> two years? He'll just go copy finished. all over himself. What is he up to? <laughs> uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while checking the hardcore virtues. Important thing is he's back. I'll let this play out. I'm just gonna get a, a rag. Hang on. <laughs> wow. I'll be back in a minute, guys. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. <laughs> Thank God I didn't go over my keyboard. Uh, what happened was my, um, my earpiece thing fell out and that made me jump and that made coffee go everywhere. <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's waste of coffee. How could I waste coffee like that? I'm still hang on, I gotta get another round. Coffee, coffee everywhere. All right, what, what, what's going on here? How'd you manage to pull this? <laughs> Trading your spleen or something? No. As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You and me? Oh, but D Buck. She's the one um, says, speaking of Batman, what do you guys think of the darker tones that they're going for in the next movie? I haven't seen the trailer for the next movie. can resist this? Am I right? Sure, Helpwood yeah. says, as long as Whatever it's good dark says. tone instead of, oh, look at me, I'm so edgy, crime, best trash. Helpwood says, uh, good that that coffee wasn't scalding hot. Well, that's true, and it was good too, it didn't go over my keyboard. I spilt it all over myself. <laughs> wow. Because I have spilt an entire, like, you know, the really large size um, coffee cups you get from, what's that coffee chain in the United States? I can always forget the name. They're big coffee chains. They're really big coffee cups. I spilt an entire one of those in my notebook once over the keyboard and all through the computer. And they needed to say like six to eight months later, the keyboard stopped working and the notebook died. So um, yeah, I was, I'm just glad I didn't spill it on my on my keyboard here. I <laughs> just all over myself. <laughs> and now I smell of coffee, which is good because we like coffee. But you're right, I'm, I'm glad it wasn't hot, scalding hot. Hellforge, Snappy Girl says, looking at the trailers, I think they'll be on the line. Creative Steve says it looks pretty good. Uh, not much of a DC fan, but going to give the upcoming reboot a go. It looks promising. Starbucks, Hellforge, yes, thank you. The big Starbucks copies. I spilled something that size all over my notebook once. 7-Eleven, Creative Steve says. You know, at Starbucks, that's what I was thinking about. The big Starbucks cups you can buy. 
Elfwood says I know the feeling. I actually knocked over a pint-sized mug of coffee a while ago, and it was time. It, it was a time cleaning it up. Yeah, well, like I said, most it all went over me, and I spilled probably half the cup on myself. So I, all I can smell now is coffee, but that's okay. We like coffee. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece. Oh. Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Well, no pressure, but uh. This whole deal is right on you now, is he? Why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back. Oh cool. Sniper Girl's linked to trailers in the uh, Discord, so check them out there. And I'll have a look at it after the stream as well. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or the Kako, but Dex is nothing his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Give them to my guy yesterday. To They're not going to get me to drive, are they? That's going to be a mistake. Scaffs. Big mistake. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Okay. <laughs> Looks like I don't have a choice. Top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Well, this is going to be fun. Bill is driving a car. Ripper Duck. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. Steer, break with this. Okay. I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. <laughs> <laughs> so sweet. Really gets me, you know? I, I can't do this. <laughs> Hang on, I've got to try and get used to what I'm doing. <laughs> this is so bad. I hope no one gets in front of me. Driving with a keyboard is weird. Yeah, this is it. <laughs> Finally, once Vic's done dusting your service. Even for me, that was just what Dex has cooked up for us. Terrible. Gonna. Why are they all running away? Did they see me drive here? I am. I go, what's going on here? Makes for easy. <laughs> Another girl says, look, Phil's driving, we're screwed. Another girl says, like uh, stay away, stay on the sidewalk. Phil's driving off the sidewalk. Oh, is 
it going to be dangerous? Amazing start, Helpwood says. Don't you worry. <laughs> Helpwood says, and the police are right there. Sniper Girl says, and the police are like, nope, not going to even bother. We get killed. Helpwood says, to be fair, driving in the game is in general I weird. CD Project knows uh, horse co horse controls. They still haven't figured out cars. Imagine a futuristic Hello? horse. Anybody there? Hey, what's going on? Stop it! These NPCs. I just want to smack them. And they say I've got my head in the clouds. Oh, Earth to me. So rude. What's going on here? Show some respect. <sighs> Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. Helpwood says those two are a couple, so they're flash. politely right, waiting for you to jog right. on so they can sleep. <laughs> oh, okay. Not because says the Helpwood sounds about right. I met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic. The uh, shading on the skin shading for the characters is quite nicely done. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Me take the good selfless fun with selfless one. Dex to Deshaun. <laughs> well. Oh, selfless yeah. one! Thank you, selfless one, for the subscription. It's a three-month sub. You are awesome, selfless one. Thank you. I'm not sure if you're in the chat though. Um. Also, uh, tomorrow on tomorrow's stream, unless somebody yeah, else redeems, play a game me. from me. Uh, I want to show some work that um that you guys have posted in the Discord gallery as well, but we'll do that tomorrow. Unless, like I said, another viewer requests I play a game. Uh, what's this? Pay you once uh, a job's me. done. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Put it on credit. That's what credit's for. Please. Sit down and relax. Okay. Is it going to hurt? Kuroshi optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Mm, that doesn't look nice. He's going to stick that in my eye. Now, Jack, oh, no. in. Do I have to? Kuroshi, whoa, Vic, nothing tops that. It's anymore. going to hurt, though. Not at all, never. So the girl says. Come in handy, <laughs> I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this <sighs> I'd be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in mm. hand. Let's check in, I guess. And prepare for the pain. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Well, then we come practice it. Don't think I've got enough to buy much. Thank you. 
Well, I can't buy much of anything. I don't have enough money. Aside from that, I don't think I can get much out. Can you just wait a sec, guys? Two seconds. I'll be back in just a sec. This one says, all art and no play keeps the gremlins at bay. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? I'm doing really well. It's good to see you, Selfless One. And again, thank you for the subscription for three months. You've been subbed up for three months now. You are awesome. And again, um, thanks, Grissom, as well, for the subscription. And Sniper Girl, thank you for gifting a sub to Creative Steve. How do I get out of it? What am I doing? What am I doing wrong here? I don't want to trade anything. I've installed that, haven't I? So what? 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 Okay, so what have I got here? Requirement not met. Requirement not met. <laughs> Snappy Girl says, Phil, uh, I think you also got to get something for hands. Ah, oh, okay. Did I put that one in? Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm, this should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do it's this. Gonna hurt, isn't it? Lay that major league arm of yours right here. <laughs> what's new in so, life before you do that? What's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine <laughs> with me. Creative Steve says, welcome back. Subtle One says, right on, I knew you were making stuff, so I'll post it in there later. And what happened? One day, I just dropped Snappy Girl says, there's a highlighted area on the hand. <laughs> yeah, I got it in the end. Thanks for the hint, though. Snappy Girl. 
some cool animations for this one. Um, Hellforge says, let's check it out. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Same as always. Don't feel a thing. You ask me that every time, you know? Not as if things are gonna be any different today. Sure thing, kid. I mean, not like there's any risk of a stroke or paralysis, but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a doctor. That's what I thought. Lights out for a minute, all right? Mm. Man. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Over the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Cool. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Cool. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say so you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. What's taking you know, so? Look at this Jackie Wells. Extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. Got cash riding on this? Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss it, don't you? Uh, how's biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corpos learned to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Good thing you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. You know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with this lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. Well, so you give up.
What's going on here? Oh, kitty cat. Kitty cat. Meow. Nice kitty cat. Because it doesn't look like it's got any fur. So it's one of those cats that doesn't have fur. Um, Snuffy Girl says start, start cutting. Sounds good. Hellwood says a day, day X, Deus Ex game has not got some really good cybernetics as well. Selfless One says I have 100 hours into this game. I refuse to finish it. Um, you can just walk away from the conversation. Yeah, <laughs> I realize that in the end. Uh, Hellwood says and come back later to pay. Selfless One says wonders who Phil will... Don't spoil it. Okay. Your heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields. And of... I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields. And avoid mean reds. V, Anything yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride. You're fully back, Android Lost? Cool. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked. There's a hard to talk on the plane while Phil was making mistakes. Okay, do my best to talk this up. <laughs> Did you see me spill a alcohol putting a coffee over myself? <laughs> Man. D, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tag hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. I'm looking at the NPCs because I heard one of the criticisms of the game when it was first released that was that they reused NPCs quite a lot. So I'm, I'm looking to see if they've actually fixed that. Uh, what's this? There are various ways to impact enemies. Non lethal. Okay. So yeah, I'm just I'm looking to see if um if they fixed it. I'm noticing this textured jacket quite a bit though. But the characters themselves look quite unique, I think. Is this guy? I know it wants me to go that way, but I just want to check the city out a little bit. Yeah, the holograms look really cool. says you're right slow. <laughs> um, Andrew Doss says all those two have the same jacket. Yeah I noticed that, that as well. But aside from that I haven't noticed too much repetition on the characters but see look we have that same jacket again. But the characters themselves all look quite unique. It's just the clothing seems to be being repeated a little bit. Uh, rename card says, wow, Phil is going in. <laughs> hey, rename card. Yeah, we're playing a game today because uh, Hellforge requested I play Cyberpunk for an extended stream. So a three hour stream today. 
Why are they doing that? See, the AI can be a little bit weird by the look of it as well sometimes. They're stuck in this scare pose. Either that or they're doing a really weird looking exercise, I don't know. Uh, the selfless one says you can you can anything you want in any order you want. Wait. Uh, Snipey Girl says they want to repeat the clothing. Why not do it if something less noticed? Yeah, that's a very good point. Yeah, if you want to repeat clothing, then don't pick some jacket that stands out from half a mile away. But aside from that, uh, so the I'm not seeing a huge amount of repetition now. in the head or what? And I've heard this about the characters being a bit dumb. Let's see we have another one here. With that jacket. What's going on out there? Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshawn in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's run. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could've had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could've just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the <laughs> Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. And sweet T-Bug helped this brother out. Andrew Lost says the characters won't become unstuck either. Helpwood says I'm traumatized from seeing you dry. Oh, <laughs> well, they're traumatized from seeing me dry, yeah. Just for you, but we'll get to that. <laughs> Uh, what class did I pick? Rename Cub? Corpo. I picked the Corpo uh, class. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype. <laughs> Snappy Girl says Fire human target. <laughs> Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. B? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum <laughs> with the Maelstrom boys. He's act of resolving that. Andrew Lutz says, that I was trying not to laugh while yeah. on the phone when you were driving. Who brought us the job <laughs> anxious. She wants to parlay with one Hey, it was hard. It was hard driving. Look, driving with a keyboard and mouse, and I am used to a controller to drive in GTA 5. It was hard. It was really hard. Client, what's her thing? Why does she need to meet? 
Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Bet knew it wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Um, rename card says, just like me, going corpo. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Hellboard says, I played as Street in my last playthrough. Uh, I've thought about doing a corpo playthrough to see what the what that changes. All right, all right, give it to me. Classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say went, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang mate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shipstream, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath, chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that, except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Um, Reno and Carl said, driving an escape drove me nuts. <laughs> you weren't here, I didn't think, when I was driving my car before. It was terrible. I could not drive it at all. It was so hard. Corpo agent, what you playing at? Hell if I know. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if... Android Lost says, this drive scene was buggy for me. The guy's lips weren't moving. Glad they fixed it. Sounds like she was waiting on the transport. Got stood up. Monochrome in the back is probably her chief suspect. We are using the latest patch for the game. From him or on him. So she's keeping him just in case. She needs to find the stolen gear before her boss has learned she fucked up. Well, Mr. V, that is some impressive deduction. Naturally, use that intel as you please. Preferably well. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. More shiny, shiny clothing. Jackster, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Me 
Nick, you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, Andrew Luss says, uh, I thought the bikes in this, uh, the bikes in this game only had bad brakes. I don't really drive the cars unless I have to. Hey, you with me, Mano? Parker, <sighs> I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Quiet! What I live. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. These not NPCs who demand your attention, and if you don't reply to them immediately, say, "Hey, what you doing?" Really annoy me. I remember to save as well. How much says that's a good good suggestion. Let's do that now. Let's make sure we do a save game, hey. I, I like the um, the lighting. I like the look of the of the city. I think they've done quite a nice job. Everybody looks so depressed, though. They're all walking around like you know. Oh, the end is near. Okay. Hey, here for a pickup. Order number forty-eight. Um, Creative Steve says I've been learning UE five lately on making my own environments with it in the node-based system. It's been a lot of fun and easy for me to grasp with my visual learning. Yeah, I I haven't actually used UE five myself yet, Creative Steve. Um, I'm waiting for Epic to release. The non preview version, which should be at the beginning of next year, from what we've heard. So, the start of sometime in the new year, the official version of UE5 should be out. But you, yeah, you can download the preview version of it now and play around with it. And I have heard it is good. I haven't played with it myself, though. Uh, I recognize those tiles. That's a substance right there. Uh, Helpwood says some areas look crazy at night uh, with all the neon coming out and full force. Yeah, I imagine it would. But even here, I, I like the sunlight. I like the way they've done the, um, the lighting. It looks pretty cool. Android Lust says you're in a slummy area. Okay. I gotta go to Lizzie's bar between 6 pm and 6 am. What's the time now? 5 40 pm. Okay. So we've got 20 minutes to kill. Sniper Girl says they have to look at your character, of course, they look... <laughs> She's saying because they have to look at me, of course they're going to be depressed. Charming, that's just charming. <laughs> um, Creative Steve says it's been pretty stable. Yeah, look, the Unreal Engine 4 is pretty stable for me as well, generally. Um, so it doesn't surprise me UE5, the preview version would be stable. Just remember, if you're making a project and you're using 4.27, you can't upgrade that project, uh, Unreal 4.27, you can't upgrade that 
to the preview version of UE5, but it will be upgradable to the official release version of UE5. So always open your projects as a copy. Creative Steve says, Phil is that scoping the programs used in each text year. Well, that's right. I, that's, that's one of the things I've, one of the main reasons I play games, because you guys know how rubbish I am at playing, is to actually check the texturing out and the environments and see what they've done and how they've done it and all that sort of jazz. That's, that's, that sort of, that really interests me. Helpwood says, I do the same when I play games. I look at all the models and textures in the game and try to backwards engineer them. Yeah, that's what I do as well. says I found myself running around a lot in this game instead of driving just to see the environments. Yeah, I'm more interested in looking at the environments than I have <laughs> in anything really. And we can't go to the bar for another... Oh, it's already six, okay. We can't go there until after six, so... So we'll walk there. Because you guys don't want to see me try and drive. You've already seen me trying to drive. It's not, not, not good. Boy, well that's just charming, run me over. Um, here I am admiring the building and and they run me over. <laughs> uh, Helpwood says some stuff is easier to figure out how they made, how they made, like if they're using a lot of the sh off the shelf smart materials and stock textures. Well, I noticed uh, on one of the buildings there, one of the textures for the tile uh, is one from Substance Painter. So, which, you know, that's why Substance Painter was made. It was made to do texturing, so hardly surprising that they're using textures from Substance Painter. Sniper Girl says, oh my god, finally almost half of the FAA Commercial Drone Study Guide. <laughs> Elfwood says I was running around to level up my stamina. Stamina. I didn't realize I had children in this game. Because you'll notice a lot of games won't put children in their game. I mean, some of them do, but yeah, a lot of them don't like to put children in their games. Because I don't like the back backlash you get from killing children in a game. If that's what you're trying to do. If you're one of those sick people that likes to kill children in a game. So most games companies just avoid the whole issue by not putting kids in games. <laughs> Elford says, and because the vehicles are broken, it's hell at launch. Sniper Girl says, we want to see you drive, try to drive. It's very good and fun to watch. <laughs> You see how many times I almost flipped the car in that short drive that I did? Looking a little put out there, Input. Interest you in a preem BD? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Sure, and I go. 
Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Um, Welcome to Lizzie's. Android Lust is admiring the building while standing in the middle of the street. But see anyway, I can get a good look at it. What'll it be? Oh, all right. These NPCs are so annoying. Um, Snappy Girl says, Phil walks in the middle of the road and he wonders why he gets hit. Amazing stuff. <laughs> Halford says he's remarkably calm about it. That happened to me a few times and I unloaded a few mags from my assault rifle at the offending cars. Yeah, but then the, will the police come after you if you do that? Android Lust says, uh, <clears throat> I don't know if I can kill them. I haven't tried. Sniper Girl says, for science, can you shoot the kids? Honestly curious about it. For science, for science. Sister Android Lust. That's where we differ. I would try it just to see if you can. Save, of course, beforehand. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a, uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn? Club's big. I'm gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. He's waiting for this one. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello sooner? I wanted to get a good look at you first. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm-hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on, know a place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a horny girl like me do for a hungry girl? Nothing's like wrong. You? Really? A little... Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. Wax. Maybe electrosex. Zappies, power implants. Hmm? Here's what I want. You and your girlfriend wearing high heels, blindfolds, and big game. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? No, just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? <laughs> Maybe Dex is beneath you. Uh, Helpo says the stock market corpo you know conversation is unlocked only because of your background. It's corpo. It's a police. If it's a police car, uh, I just have to make sure my aim is true. You write in Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Curious. 
Shit, buzz decks right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fiction. Android Luff says I'll try the next time I play, but the kids sales, don't though. deserve it. I'll go uh, with I won't lie, too. there's been some good emotional moments in this game. Yeah, I've heard some good things about the story in this game. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Arasaka seems to have quite the touch with that hotel chain. But I gotta say, Compeki in Tokyo still leagues above the rest. Two are identical to each other. Japan staff, huh? The service can't be beat. Singapore, Paris, Washington. All the rest act like charity case cousins by comparison. Well, it's hard to argue with that. True. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? In Night City? Guess the scream sheets weren't lying this time. It's on the lips of everyone in the city. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son, heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire, in town. <laughs> Please. Could it be? Emperor's prepared to cede his throne after 150 years? <laughs> Doubt it. Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yori's balls in a vice for years. He might just... Turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Even so, it's still Yorinobu fucking Arasaka. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Uh, Snappy Girl says to Android Lust, it's a game. Not sure if, if uh, it's deserving, if, if deserving is possible either way. Android Lust says, I got to immerse. Why do you think we play games? It's for the immersion. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Android Lust says, I got to immerse. Where's he hiding it? Likely in a uh, sniper girl doesn't as much. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. Uh, Helford says those symbols you see next to some of the conversation That's options are dependent on the skills Provided you have. We're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Heard a bit about Yorinobu. Study finance and biotech in Tokyo. Probably to please his father. Mm hmm. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu cut himself off from the corp. Joined the Steel Dragons, nomads from Tokyo. Heard they were planning an Arasaka coup, or its downfall. Hmm. That flash of youthful rebellion ended like it usually does. Yorinobu returned to the fold, but the bitter taste remained. The reflection the on the door there from the character and but stuff, it's all no, no, part of the ray tracing, it's nicely done. 
intelligent man who has his own designs on the corp. Seems to be risking everything with this relic scam. Yes, because he's fallen for the biggest lie this town puts forward. That he can gain and retain control of anything. Yeah, I thought it was a nice detail to see the reflection of the character there in that metal part of the door. I'm waiting. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Of course. Jacking off too in those like boxes. Me, babe. No. It can be a very useful tool. No, good no, for don't think. Analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. We might, uh, leave it there, though, I think, guys and girls. I'm just gonna save a new game. Uh, I do want to thank you guys, though, very much for hanging out with me and for watching me try and, try and drive a car and play a game. <laughs> it was a lot of fun. Um, I will be back on again tomorrow, of course, at... 5 p.m. Pacific time in the United States. Uh, and unless somebody wants me to play a game again and redeem their viewer points, we will be doing some 3D work in uh, Substance Painter. <laughs> so, thanks for your quite welcome. I had a lot of fun playing Cyberpunk. I, 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 the game looks great. I haven't, like I said, played it since I bought it. Um, I will try and hold off playing it, though, in case you guys want to redeem it in the future. We can pick up where we left off, like I did with The Witcher. Um, yes, so tomorrow we will be working on the gate in Substance Painter. Uh, we've got to see if we can fix that problem we had last week where we were getting uh, the bake out wasn't working quite correctly. But we'll look at that tomorrow. Snappy Girl says, agreed. Didn't you notice the reflection of the holographic dancer in the reflection? Um, you're quite welcome. Yes, thank you guys very much for hanging out. Again, I want to thank selfless one for the three month subscription um crimson d for the subscription as well and again thanks sniper girl for subbing uh, for gifting a sub to creative steve um you guys and girls take care have a good night and i will hopefully see you all again tomorrow at 5 p.m see you guys